So I realized that inside me, it's kind of like a room that that I am seeing and the light switch is off. So it's completely dark and I feel like I'm in a dark place. But then I found the light switch and I realized that the same room can be my, my home and my safety harbor if I can access the light, light switch. And I realized that the light, light switch is in that room. It's inside my body and it's inside my mind. I just need to find it. So that was the, the big, big thing that led me into taking meditation. And I think meditation is one of the best things you can do if you have pain or any kind of anxiety, depression, self-doubt, anything, because you need the self-awareness first and you need the acceptance of anything that your body and mind is going through so that you can start observing it and then start healing it. Yeah. Instead of like trying to like ignore it or even run away from it, you have to look at it, like observe it and acknowledge it. Right. Exactly. Because this, that's something that's in you and only you can take it away. And only you can decide how you are going to focus on it or how you are going to, yeah, what's your attitude towards it. So it's like, almost like, you know, this manifest manifestation thing. If you're thinking all the time, I'm in pain, I'm in pain, I'm suffering. That's what you are creating more. Mm, yeah. But then if you turn the idea around and I actually started training like this. So whenever I got pain, I started training this, just mindfully ob observing the pain and then self-compassion. So just repeating to myself these phrases, you know, I am well, I am loved, I am happy, I'm in peace, my nervous system is healing, my nervous system is healthy. And it starts to transcend the pain experience. And sometimes I still got the pain, but it wasn't disturbing me that much. Um, and after that, yeah. I started using natural tools like sleep and diet and exercise and supplements and pretty holistic tools, as well as continuing the meditation. And all that then led into the um, getting to the remission. Wow. Amazing. So is that what you mean by like letting go of your pain identity to start healing? Is like, don't identify with your pain, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like you need to turn the mindset of I'm suffering into I'm healing. And that's when you start healing. Okay. So it's, it's a simple shift, but it's like, it's a mindset shift. Yeah. It's a mindset shift and it's not always easy. Like it's, it's, um, it takes a little bit of work to believe it. Yeah. That you, you can do it. And I believe anyone can do it. I never thought when I was young that I would be in a migraine remission really. And I, I was just thinking that if I get 50% less pain, I'll be happy. And now that I've gone through this journey, I'm really here to tell, you know, people that you can do and heal your body very holistically if you just believe it that it's possible. Mm.